Hi guys. So today we are talking about uh, a new approval given by our uh, government of India, and that is the emergency approval regarding this Sputnik V vaccine of Russia. So guys, uh, as you know that uh, we are having a like surge in the COVID cases a lot. A lot of cases are coming up. All the COVID scenario is very bad uh, in several metros. and i hope uh, this particular uh, step of the government is a key to curb up this pandemic in the near future because uh, this particular uh, russian vaccine is being produced up by our various pharma giants and all and uh, they are playing a key role to produce up a large doses like around 50 crores and obviously that will prove very beneficial for uh, like curbing of this pandemic so let's uh, quickly know that uh, what is there in this and how does it acts upon so guys uh, this vaccine is a viral vector vaccine and you know that which other is a viral vector vaccine that is the astrazeneca vaccine that is also a viral vector vaccine this is also a viral vector vaccine so doctor what's the difference guys the difference is uh, that was a chimpanzee adenovirus and here they are using a what human adenovirus okay and it is being prepared up by this particular institute that is termed as uh, gamelia research institute okay that is uh, of epidemiology and microbiology and as i have told you that this is letter v not the roman numeral for 5 and it is a adenovirus viral vector vaccine okay and uh, i have already told up that it is a human adenovirus this time which encodes the full length spike protein to stimulate the immune response now this is important that which particular types we are using up so type 26 and 5 they are being used up and what they are coding of these guys recombinant adenovirus virus they are coding up sars corona virus 2 s protein complementary dna okay they are coding this particular thing and this particular vaccine is given up in the deltoid it's fine firstly we give this ad26 on the first day and this ad5 vaccine is given up on 21st day to boost the immune response okay then uh, this exists in two particular forms one is uh, ready to use the solution in water another one is a freeze dried powder that is a life flies form okay and this is being stored at minus 18 this particular solution in water and this uh, particular thing can be managed up at 2 to 8 degree centigrade and obviously this is easy to carry upon to transport and all this fried rice powder okay now basically uh, this is uh, like a repetition of the same thing what else is there in this these particular components are there like tris amino methane sodium chloride magnesium chloride sucrose disodium edta polysorbate 80 ethanol and water okay so they are uh, present up to maintain up the various buffer conditions and all that and uh, the good thing is uh, that uh, the russian direct investment fund rdi if tied up with various indian pharmaceutical players like dr reddy's lab panacea biotech gland pharma to produce up these vaccine doses at the earliest and in a very huge amount of around 50 crores and guys a good thing is the efficacy of this vaccine is above 90 which is not there with co vaccine and covid shield but this is there and no major side effect is being reported from this sputnik 5 and guys one thing from my personal experience i like to tell up that the vaccine is working and if you have your doses properly then definitely you are protected against the corona virus and obviously against the new variants also if at all you get also then it's a very mild stuff okay people are getting infected after vaccine both vaccines also but the only good thing is that no severity is happening up except a few cases that will always remain exception but overall majority like uh, definitely i am saying that uh, get vaccinated for sure okay and this particular uh, new addition will definitely add the boost to the war against covid and soon this particular pandemic will become very weak or definitely like uh, it will help up in many aspects india to formulate a lot of things against this particular covid 19 okay and this surge will definitely be put to rest very soon okay let's hope for the best don't lose hope very best of luck for your exam and uh, do your best and uh, don't be in this tension what will happen on that day and which day just prepare well and be focused and uh, like uh, the last few days guys i know that uh, it's all about uh, revisions so just revise up all your charts all your tables 
which you know that uh, they are important and you forget them frequently okay so that maybe that will help up because uh, from that particular thing only you will get few questions from those tables and all that stuff like uh, from my microbiology point of view i would like to tell up that incubation period video or incubation period uh, the chart or from wherever you get because uh, that is a very high yield topic from that two to three questions can come that what is the incubation period of this particular disease incubation period of that particular disease okay guys so thank you so much very best of luck let's hope this vaccine makes a turnover to curb up this pandemic thank you so much